All right, folks, the deck is even, Paladin. We're gonna make use of a freshly unnerfed Call to Arms to bring some really high value two mana minions into play and beat our opponent over the head with them. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash raffle. Watch this! I will fight with honor. Keep this and look for Call to Arms, which we will coin out. This helps test for counter. This should be a fine matchup, though, if we get better cards than this. Would you run face or Lotheb and Face Hunter? Um, if it's Odd Hunter, maybe. We have turned our curse into our strength. Just because you want to be faster than that, like Lotheb is a five mana card that's very slow. Let's see what we get here first. Wait, is this just unplayable? I cannot wait to read these. It's a bummer. Well, not keep the discount? No, uh, Gen is your starting hero power. Yeah, but Murloc's energy, I don't have <laughs> Murloc's energy, unfortunately. So trade ping. Means I probably have to go face with this. Just to play around fair game. No one playing new decks. I mean, I am. And also, many of my opponents have been. But this opponent is at rank one, or diamond one, so... Excuse me. They're probably trying to hit legend. I need to find the call to arms or I'm gonna lose this game. Okay. Manageable. But true hard upgrading a one cost hero power make it still it I I can't read that sentence and have my brain remain intact. But uh, true heart would not be good in this deck if that's what you're asking. How many even cards are there for pure strategy? Well, the fact that Gen is required for the deck kind of is limiting for a pure strategy. Good order. Oh, okay. Didn't get a taunt, but that's kind of expected in this situation. Uh, we can buff up the Kangor so that it gets a little bit more healing. And then on turn six, we have a hammer, which gives us a pretty good swing turn. I could also even just play the Blessing of Kings on the uh, Kangor if we don't see a new secret. They are going face. Okay, so it's got to be this then. Because I can't risk uh, the Blessing of Kings into Counterspell. Opponent knows the place? I don't think that they do, no. <laughs> I would not agree with that statement. Uh, I am going to have to play around... Oh my god. Um... Flame Ward a little bit here. I think I want to start with this. None may steal our secrets. Hey, well, I wasn't going to have to play around Flame Ward, and then that happened. We just, like, mega sniped that, <laughs> uh, that scientist there. So. Reporting for duty. This, like, potentially gets wrecked by a Flame Ward. Um, but I kind of need to... Uh, hero power first, just to get the the shots in. I wonder if I even attack their face into Flame Ward. Because I already did damage to face, right? Because I want to preserve this on board so that it could pot um, potentially get buffed by the Blessing of Kings. I don't think mages still use Flame Ward. Some of them do. Some of them definitely do. And I don't think it's a worthwhile risk to take when I have two really high impact minions that I want to keep alive. Okay. I think I can just go here. Let's actually go... Am 
Am I taking four here? I think I am. Four puts me to ten. I don't have much healing left, so this might be a a punt. Warlock Blessing, I haven't tested for Counterspell yet, so I don't really want to just, like, give away four mana for free. That's why. I think I have to go face here. Should be fine from here. Unless they have double double fireball. So that's definitely Flame Ward, right? I think we're popping at three no matter what, so... I think maybe this is just worth keeping in case it's actually Odd Paladin. Okay. Figured it was more likely to be a mirror match because patch day. Yeah. See if we can get something sturdy here. This challenge is their 1-1, one, one, which is really what I want. I want to be able to sneak, a, sneak in a knife juggler next turn. Excuse me? I didn't know that there was going to be a test today. Starving Buzzard is so busted. Yeah, that's going to be one of the next cards I play. I'm really looking forward to that. I don't know how I want to build it, though, because... Like, I want to do Death Rattle things with Undertaker. But I also want to, like, do Beast things, because... That's the point of Starving Buzzard, but... We'll see how it works out. So we're probably playing the Crab Rider to try and clear as much as we can next turn. So that we can keep this, um juggler alive as long as possible. Let's actually start here. See if we can snipe that off. Okay, that makes this more necessary now. Okay. Mm well, see you later, old friend. I'm trying Toxic Reinforcements with Undertaker. Yeah, like, I don't know at what point you lose the... Well, it's possible we lose to that. That's how the matchup used to go. However, they didn't get good hits off of that because they're running this boy. I didn't realize they buffed this, even in the core set. It's a good hit. That allows me to make this play. And then go face. That's not a good card. Oh hey, I drew my card. <laughs> this matchup is literally just who draws the first and who draws the most call to arms. I want to slam a Soundkeeper next turn. Put this apple on your head. Most of the time. Mm. Okay, go face. Face. Or here. Oh, that's no good. I don't think Angora does belong to the Titans here. See if we can snipe some uh, some of these. For duty. 
Nice. Hit the other one now. Oh! I'm so good at Hearthstone. Just need to dodge that second um, Consecration, but I don't think you're running double Consecration in the year 2021. You're so good at juggling? Actually, I'm pretty good at juggling. Fun fact. I learned in the sixth grade and it's like riding a bike you just kind of never forget. Need proof? I don't know if I have any tennis balls on hand. Because the dogs eat them. This curse has become our greatest strength. Weapon ready. Reporting for duty. Angora belongs to the fight. The battle. Just want to set up for a kill next turn. Tennis ball so delicious. Yeah, Juno, uh, the husky, does this weird thing where he, as soon as he gets a tennis ball, his only, his only concern is just removing the green fluff from it, and it makes a huge mess. Mess. So close. Winter is here. Can you stop? I just want to make you dead. Uh, you're still dead. Bonk. Uh, let's find a call to arms. <laughs> I think that's how we win games of Hearthstone most of the time. It's just like drawing the call to arms and then playing it. Probably a quest rogue if I had to guess. Into our strength. What is better, a 2-2 two -two or two one ones? Uh, it depends. Not a question with a universal answer. I think I want to try and land the uh, hand of a doll on the murder. Could Reno Hero Power Mage exist? Yes. I think it will be good next expansion. That's one of the first decks I want to try. I'm debating whether I... W like, I think that's a better deck than Even Mage will be. But I think people will be, like, asking for Even Mage a lot more. Probably should have waited to see what this was. I didn't think about the fact that I had zero mana cards in my deck. Ooh, Shuffle Rogue. Well, let's try and uh, hit a Blessing of Kings next turn. Not more dash. What? Yeah, that's why I think Reno Hero Power Mage will be good, is because of that card. Two one ones is better than one one one, that's for sure. Why are you broken, buddy? What happened to you, Murger? Oh my god! Um, I've got lethal with the weapon next turn, so... So even if this gets cleared, it's not that big of a deal. That could be a big deal. This looks like a uh, famous Wild Hurston and streamer Get Me Out's Shuffle Rogue. Unfortunate that they don't yet have Mancrick. No taunt, please. Thanks. 
for justice. Bonk. The light shall bring victory. I will fight with honor. We have turned our curse. Uh, priest in general is not a good matchup for us. So, just gonna, oh, that's actually better for me. Because we get our board cleared slightly less often, I think. Make sure I have here power mana feeder. Pretty good on a corpse taker if uh, it survives a turn. That's pretty good with a juggler up, so might consider that as well. Rip juggler? Is that hysteria? That's a better place to put it. Please kill the juggler. Thank you. Kind of wanted that to happen a little bit faster, but... I did Quest Rogue perform? I have no idea because uh, Deck Tracker wasn't recording stats, but it seemed to do pretty well. Like, my legend number is lower than when I started with Quest Rogue. You plan on streaming Classic? Um, maybe. No plans right now because I've got, like, a lot of wild decks to play. Pretty good corpse taker. I was hesitant to play the uh <laughs> to play the alley cat because of spirit lash, but at the same time it's like more stats are better than plus stats. Uh, this is the turn before Psychic Scream, so I feel like it's a good turn to get that going. How are we doing on the quest? Three? Yeah. We're in a fine spot. Deck Tracker will get a patch later in the day? Yeah. It's just not having its best time right now. It's a really unfortunate uh, that they got their second Hysteria there. I think I want to do this before I get rid of all of the... All of the, like, buff effects from my deck. I'm not sure about that attack into the 1-1, one -one, but I want to preserve the shield if I can. Second Lash would be a bummer. Oh my god. It's double Lash, double, uh, Hysteria is brutal. Speaking of brutal. Let's give this Knife Juggler a uh, charge. I think I keep the weapon swing for one more turn, because I only have one additional weapon in my deck. How's this going? Four out of seven. Yeah. All right. Can we make the opponent dead here? The answer is yes. Alright, a hunter is probably playing... I will fight with honor. Uh, Buzzard? Did I watch the Snyder Cut? I did. Uh, I watched it over the weekend, I think, or early this week. We have turned our curse into our strength. Greetings. I trust you will not waste my time. Well met. I'll try not to. Hold on. 
I missed that the first time we played this earlier. But that's pretty sweet that they gave Snow Flipper Penguin its own animation. Finally, some justice. Also, Mokus. I'm a little bit less excited about that now. I'd rather give this away than the uh, knife juggler. The cute hunter buff we needed. I think the cute hunter buff is more about um, starving buzzard, but sure. Um, you still you should play the buffed odd shaman. It still works until barons. Yeah, but I don't feel great about playing a deck that's not going to be not going to exist. That's only going to exist for five days. That it's kind of a feels bad man in, in my opinion. I think I'm going to coin the uh, Corpse Taker, force them to double trade into this, and then I follow it up with the Call to Arms. Sure. Oh god, no, the Call to Arms off the birds. Oof. That's kind of gross. I hope Millhouse gets run again because of Even Paladin. I mean, he will, but it's making the deck worse. You don't want cards that only exist in the deck to get cold, pulled, pulled from Call to Arms. Like, at least Injured Tolvir is fine on its own. Alright, let's thin our deck of those birds. Wait, we got zero birds. All I heard is, oh god, no, before cutting to an ad. You shouldn't have gotten an ad. Pre-roll ads are off, I would assume, and I didn't run a mid-roll, so. Something's going on with Twitch, if that's the case. I should probably kill that. And it's not terribly difficult to do. But we've got a lock on the board. Doo doo. You say don't run minions only for the call to arms, but run again for the same reason. Yep. That is a direct comparison and definitely the same thing. I guess that's checkmate. I should just give you my stream key and uh, you can stream here now. I think those are the rules of how it works. Alright. I think I just roll for jugglers here. If this hits the buzzard, I'll hero power. I'm still tempted to hero power anyway because they're ahead on cards. And I do kind of want to get value off of this. Even though it's very good into, or like it's better into the board. Let's get value off of it. That's an oof. Buzzard is so good, it's true. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, it's been doing some strong things against me. Oh, God. I didn't even think about Corridor Creeper. I mean, I have to kill the beaver here. Otherwise, I might die. Blind Marion, thank you for the three months. I heard you're giving your stream away. Will my streak move on to the new owner? I believe so. So thank you for the, thank you for the three months. I appreciate you sneaking it in there before I lose my stream. Stranger Things, thank you for the Prime. I see the opponent has decided to let none survive. Which very much appears to include me. Okay, that's a start. 
Moose Milk, thank you for the Prime. Why didn't they unnerf Creeper? To make sure that they made good choices? Let me think. For justice. And before somebody says, but Ravo, they unnerfed Quest Rogue, so clearly they don't make good choices. It's too late, chat. I think I need the freeze here. And I sure hope they don't have a second kill command. Okay. Okay. That's actually fine for me, right? Start by drawing. This is potentially the payoff for patience here. Okay. I should really find a taunt minion. I don't want to take any extra damage here. But I will retain the hammer here. Gag and Dragon, thank you for the under bits. Wait, Raffle lost his chat? Is this gladiator rules were all battle for the right to be Raffle? Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, I lost my entire stream, actually, so I'm going to have to start applying for jobs, I guess. Dan Rough Rider Schneider, thank you for the seven months. Still love the content. Thanks for giving me something to do while I watch while I eat. Well, I hope you enjoy your meal. And I hope this opponent doesn't make me dead. I have to kill that. Da. I'm sorry, cute cat. Okay, it's uh, just kill command. I can't remember how many they've played. I think it's only been one. Although, if I keep clearing their, um, their minions, it's not active. At least that's not good. Please don't kill me. Also, Leroy, they're not running Leroy if they have uh, Master's Call. It's like just kill command. As Reach here. Oof. Dodged it. Oh, yeah, Unleash the Hounds definitely would have gotten me too. Which is a card that they're definitely running because the synergy with Starving Buzzard. I think I'm likely to be able to stick a minion on one. And so just going Hero Power, Hand of a Doll into Call to Arms is pretty good. We have turned our curse into our strength. Do you can't play no ranked? Astounding. For duty. Yes. Or no, I... Maybe. It's good for next turn. The battle. Hey, I have beasts in my deck too. That might have been nice to have in my deck for next turn, but we'll see. My dad owns Blizzard and he can ban your account if you're on mobile. Well, my uncle is Mr. Nintendo, so I think that overwrites. Okay. 
just pull an early knife juggler forehead. I said an early knife juggler. Is that bird a new card? No, it's an unnerfed card. It's a very, very old card that uh, was dominant for quite some time. And I'm very glad to see that the opponent used it early <laughs> so that I don't lose this game as often. Oh my god, no. Okay. That means this isn't getting cleared, at least. Oh my god. That's absolutely disgusting. Call to Arms is a bonkers card. Do I even need it here, though? I could go here, 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 and then Hero Power. I think this is better. I wonder. I'm likely to pull another juggler. Or I'm just likely to miss all of my juggles somehow. Today I don't have to Weapon ready. Okay. That seemed like a fair turn. Hong Kong. Hong Kong. Well played. Right, is that lethal? There's a lot of weirdness going on today. Am I disconnected again? Didn't they remove Rush from the boar? I don't understand, yeah. Thank you to legendary patrons Anonymous Toast, Fizzle Jizzix, Jeffrey Pierce, Justice Crater, Keys404, Noggleshear, Shadow1TV, Sognisman, and Vanfix.